When a game doesn't run at your preferred frame rates, in what order do you reduce resolution, turn down settings, use upscaling? Which gives the biggest performance boost for the lowest loss in visuals? Is upscaling better than reducing resolution, i.e. would you rather run 4K with performance upscaling or 1080p native? So yeah, I mean, immediately I would just not run at a lower resolution on a display. I think it looks trash. So if you had a 4K display, definitely I would never recommend running games at native 1080p or 1440p. It's not going to look good um, just simply because you can't scale those things onto monitors as well. So it's always got to be reduced resolution is like the last, the very last thing that you would ever consider doing because it'll just make the game look really blurry. Unless the monitor has a native 1080p mode. Because I watched a recent monitor's unboxing. Even then, that mode does not like... Okay. It looks fine for competitive gaming but mm-hmm. you if you're playing like a visual game where you're concerned about mm-hmm. quality settings making it look nice with the performance you'd be wanting to run that on the 4k mode as much as possible yeah. the 1080p mode is very much for like your competitive gameplay where you turn everything down and you want the best frame rate sure so as far as like the main things i'd be considering between turning down settings and using upscaling like it really depends on the resolution of your display for starters because upscaling is much more effective at 4k than is at 1080p so like 4k performance mode probably looks better than 1080p with quality upscaling Mm -hmm. so you kind of have to factor that in and then with settings that can depend on the game some settings you can get a very large performance benefit from turning ultra to high with very little performance and very little quality loss which means that for like upscaling you know, you might see more visual artifacts from using upscaling versus just turning ultra to high. So generally, I'd say based on the games that I've looked at, that you'd want to turn from ultra to high first before using upscaling. I think a lot of the reduction in things like volumetric fog, shadow resolution can be very difficult to notice. So if I'm thinking of like a cyberpunk, for example, and you're not factoring in the ray trace settings, turning from ultra to high is a very easy way to gain performance. Then I'd probably start thinking about upscaling to some degree before going to like medium or low settings because often those can start much more noticeably dropping those features so yeah that's sort of the order i'd think about but again it would depend on the resolution if i'm playing at 1080p i'd be much more keen on dropping from ultra to medium rather than using Mm -hmm. upscaling and it can depend on the upscaling technology as well maybe if you had dlss available to you you'd choose that first but if you were on an amd gpu maybe prefer medium settings with no fsr versus ultra with fsr and again it depends heavily on the resolution and that's why we've had to make so many videos talking about upscaling technologies in all sorts of different configurations in all sorts of different games because what you find at 4k using certain modes absolutely does not apply at 1080p and lower resolutions Mm -hmm. so it's a really complicated discussion and i can't just sit here and say yeah this is my order in every situation that said i would always put lowering the resolution of the game last That's, Mm -hmm. that's a pretty safe bet yeah, I 100% agree with that answer. So that's what I would have said as well. 